Okay, as I said, I'm not going to sit and debate with this. I'm going to make a video and show you, so here it is. First is the PCSX2 1.1.0. Under configuration, as you can see, I have it set to Direct 3D11 software, which is what the, everybody's saying games can run in. I'm going to show you that I have Burnout, um, Burnout Revenge as the ISO, and I'm going to boot this in full CD, and you're going to see exactly what happens when a game is run in software mode. Watch how slow the title of this goes. Okay, that's the first thing. So once I get into the game itself, you'll see exactly how slow the game is going to run. And then when I press F9, you'll see the game will speed up. Then I'm going to stop this video, and I'm going to show you, I'm going to reconfigure it as hardware settings. I'm going to show you what happens when you run the game. So these are both two things. So let me get in here and, and do this real quick. Now, one thing I'm going to point out is that in hardware mode, you'll see that the windows on this, there's no purple or, you know, purplish missing textures in software mode when it's running here, I guess. So let me choose this, and I'll show you what happens when we get into the game. As you can see, the loading screens and everything run perfectly in this. The problem is when you get into the game itself. Watch how slow this runs. You're not going to tell me that this is running full speed in software mode. Now, I'm going to press F9. Watch how slow the clock goes. Now, I'm going to press F9. As you can see, it totally speeds up when you press F9. But if I press F9 again, it's reset back to hardware mode. I'm sorry, software mode. Now, I'm going to pause. The, I'm going to stop the video, and I'm going to launch the game in hardware mode and show you the difference. I'm going to switch this. Hardware mode. Now watch this. Watch the... Um, Okay, goes, goes perfectly normal. Now, pay attention to the purplish, wind, purplish tint inside the windows that weren't there before. Now watch how fast the game runs. Again, this is hardware mode compared to software mode. As you can see, the loading screens are exactly the same. But the uh, difference here is that I have a purple purplish tint in the car. Now, as you can see, the game is running perfectly fine, and this is hardware mode. So you guys are getting confused with launching the game with running the game. So I just wanted to make a video to show that because um, I'm just not going to sit and argue with people about, about facts that they're talking about while I'm showing it in video. And the other thing, too, is don't post comments about using all this lingo that nobody can make he that only people on the forum can make heads or tails out of because I have no idea what anybody's talking about with these thread optimizations or whatever and, it, and all this other stuff is because none of that means anything to me and all of the guides do the same thing they throw these words out there and assume you know what the stuff means and when you don't know what they tell you to look it up I spent four or five days looking this stuff up on the forum and have no idea what any of the stuff is a guy all the guides need to be revised 
with stating this is what this means when you set this here, period. And as for the term playable, playable means the game can move at a, at a, at a good enough speed. When you're dealing with games like Snowblind, we all know that they don't run properly. They should not be on the compatibility list as playable because they're not playable. So I just wanted to clarify that, and um, that's it. So you guys should need to fix, fix all of the guides and stuff like that.